just add a mesh plane and scale it up a bit then go to edit mode right click subdivide 100 times then go to sculpt mode sculpt however you like well feel free to copy mine Then back into edit mode, select the area where you want to scatter grass, go to vertex group, add a vertex group and hit assign. Then add a hair particle system, change the hair settings however you want. And go to vertex group and select the vertex group that you just created. To render the grass faster under render set the steps to 1 and now change the diameter root of the grass to 0.2 now go to edit preferences search sapling tree generator and turn on this add-on now go to add curve sapling tree generator and I am going to use the weeping willow tree and now scale it so that it fits in your scene now select the part of the tree on which the leaves will scatter and add a vertex group and make sure to assign it and now I am going to model just a simple leaf. Now create a particle system for the tree and under render set it to object and set the instance object to our leaf. And now assign the vertex group on the first tree and then increase its number. And now in the shader editor, I am going to assign a shader to the leaves and feel free to copy that. And then assign a bark material to the tree. You can find it easily on the internet. Then assign a grass material to the ground. Now under world settings in the color, click this yellow dot and set the color to sky texture feel free to play with the sky texture or just you can copy mine and then just add a point light set its color to orange and bump up its power to 10,000 and size to 5 meter To make the scene look good, I am going to copy this tree and place it near my camera so it gives a good effect. Now go to edit preferences, type in images and you will find images as planes. Click that add on. And then add image images as planes and you will find the image link is in the description. I call this image as godress because it gives god like feeling. Make sure to place it behind the tree and now in the render settings set the look to medium high contrast and play with the exposure value and then just render it and that's pretty much it we have our nature landscape in just 5 minutes if you like this video hit that subscribe button now